boys and girls. This is skill session for week one. Week one, we're going to be doing grip strength. So grip strength is good for your overall game, but in particular, it's gonna help you with your passing and also the ability to change hands with the ball. Uh, I'm gonna give you now a few uh, different exercises that you can do at home. You can, if you don't have a footy, hopefully you do, but if you don't, you can use it with any type of ball. You can do some of these while you're sitting in front of the telly or while you're in the backyard. So first off, Mr. O'Brien is gonna be going around his legs, okay? Ball around the legs, making sure you're changing that hand, the ball in each hand, okay? That's number one. Uh, number two, we're going to be doing figure eight. So putting that ball through your legs, around the other side, and back through. So figure eights, Mr. O'Brien. There we go. Make sure you're getting a good grip of that ball. Awesome. And then reverse and go back the other way. Righto, number three. Uh, this one is catching in between your legs. So Mr. O'Brien is going to get that ball in between his legs. One hand in front of the body, one hand behind. And then he's going to alternate and catch that ball. Beauty. Oh. Right on, this one here is number four. This is really going to give your forearm a workout. If you're a beginner, all you're going to do is start at the tip of the ball, grab, release, and grab as quickly as you can. You don't want that ball to hit the ground. So Brian, starting at the tip. As you start to progress through and you become confident with that, you want to start to get more to the meat of the ball, okay? Try and get up in the middle. Right, so then to finish off, once you feel confident with all of that, you're going to progress to doing all of these activities while you're moving. So you might go figure eights through the legs or around the waist, okay? Keep walking, and then you might start to do that grip strength. You might even want to change hands, okay? There you go, there's our skill session for week one. Spend about 10 or 15 minutes each day on that, and we'll see you next week.